All right, supplement grab bag. What do we got here? I think these are all brand new. I'm gonna have to try these. Usually I've tried these in the past, the Vega, and this looks like Vega, but it says fermented vegan proteins plus, genuine health. So maybe this is a different company in general. What does this say here from Genuine Health? All right. Well, it looks like Vega labels, if you guys ever seen that before. I'll try that out. Got a chocolate flavored. Chocolate flavored, vanilla flavored. A couple extras. Maybe I'll do a giveaway on my Instagram. Hit me up. Sports salts. <clears throat> with pink Himalayan salt. I should do a video all about what I know on the um, cell salts. It's pretty fascinating stuff. And does this have cell salts in it? No, it just looks like trace minerals. So, I will check that out. Never used that before. x -Lear. This is actually very popular right now for sinus congestion. It's x -Lear. It's got uh, nasal rinse kind of that you can bring with you on the go should be non habit forming but that's up to you I believe I always like to say it that way and it's uh, xylitol which is known for its antimicrobial antibacterial kind of hookup so this is actually really good I do suggest this to a lot of people if they're looking for a nasal spray um, I've also heard xylitol could be good inside of mouthwashes as well so that's a very popular product I've used that this is actually really smart from uh, a lot of companies doing this now. You can use these. Okay, well, these are purifying wipes with kale, cucumber, mangosteen, facial towelettes. Let's see how they smell. Pacifica does have some stuff that's really good smelling. I like it a lot. Some of their lotions. Ah, uh, I... I don't know how to describe that. I can tell the cucumbers in there, and honestly, it smells cucumber and seaweed like to me. I don't know. Maybe you're into that. Maybe you're not. Anyways, Pacifica's a pretty good brand. I like a lot of their stuff. Carlson, I usually suggest um, Nordic Naturals because of European standards that they stick to. Um... I've made a video about when I chugged a whole bottle of oil, Carlson's lemon flavored fish oil. Check that out. This paleo protein powder is actually pretty awesome. Very nice. Some of them are egg proteins and grass fed, not whey. Um, so that's going to be better for you. But I don't like to see natural flavors because I remember learning about natural flavors from the food babe. She said uh, the natural flavoring for strawberries comes from beaver anus. So that's kind of scary. I'm not sure what natural flavors are in here, but I know this tastes good. It can be really expensive for a larger portion. Both of those have liked those tastes. Mangosteen from Emerald. I really like the Emerald brand, Mangosteen. Not sure of all these different health benefits for the mangosteen, but I know it's regarded as a superfood. I'll have to give you guys an update on that later. Sealed? Anybody want this? Hit me up on Instagram. Uh, let's see. Lip food from Eco Lips. Brand new. It's got essential oils. Lavender. I just made a video about essential oils, and yeah, lavender is not one that I suggest for men, not for regular use. Probably not on your lips either. Uh, rosemary, mint, chamomile, and mushroom. Interesting. I've never heard of putting mushrooms into a lip balm. I will try that out. Eco Lips. I think this is by Pacifica, the same company, maybe. Anyways, those are good labels right there with all the non GMO. But yeah, let's see. All good lips. Elemental herbs. I tried another one of these, I think it might be in my pocket, a chai one right now, I've been using, and it's actually pretty nice. Let's see, yeah, here's a this chai one, I actually kind of like that. 
it's difficult in the summertime to keep this stuff on you because sometimes it'll just melt in your pocket, but yeah, it's not overwhelming flavor, taste, smell, anything like that. Nice moisturizing. That's really smart that a lot of these companies are doing these underarm deodorant wipes so you don't have to like go to the bathroom and like scrub your armpits with the sink. Anyways, um, I was just talking to a Pacifica rep recently about uh, the titanium dioxide in some products nowadays and zinc dioxide. Some of those are getting bad wraps because they're nanoparticles and it's not really certain how they affect the body. So the cool thing about Pacifica is they use natural formulations for their sunscreens, etc. I made a sunscreen video recently too. Um, but yeah, I don't usually suggest people use sunscreens, but that's smart. I, I like this idea for a lot of people. I also made a video a long time ago about internal deodorants. You should check that out. So more grab bag. <clears throat> Trace minerals. I've been learning more and more about trace minerals like every single day. Videos just keep on popping up. This is one that I've been using quite a bit. The Soleil method of salt intake. You take like a tablespoon and just saturate water until it doesn't dissolve anymore and do like a tablespoon of that every single day and that's a good way to get salt as well. I was just talking about this with a family member yesterday about how um, China has a longer life expectancy than us and most likely it's due to their higher salt intake. What do we got? Melatonin Plus, 5-HTP and Rhodiola. So 5-HTP, known as a mood enhancer. Rhodiola, good for energy. But melatonin, I don't usually suggest that to people simply because I've seen studies that suggest it probably shortens life expectancy. I don't need that. And then I also, I don't like this brand because every single Irwin product on the label, it says, contains soy and it gives me no indication that this is non-gmo soy in there and ain't nobody got time for that it looks like there's a lot of other good things in here and with flaxseed being the major component i would not suggest this for men either because that's pseudo estrogen but yeah i hate the Irwin company because every single thing like i said it's probably got gmo soy in it so how is that a health product Natural Calm Vitality, I made a video about that. I don't use this, would not suggest this, simply because uh, Labdoor.com rated it high in arsenic. They gave it a 50 out of a 100 rating. I used to use it. I noticed it was an extreme diuretic for me. Don't use it anymore. Bad idea. Chloroxygen, this is amazing stuff. Uh, this is one of the things that can reduce body odor, and you can... Uh, Use this if you're gonna hike mountains because this will oxygenate your blood and help you feel better. More energized. Uh, definitely, for me, I had to take it in the morning. Salty Waves Beach Hair Balm. So this banana smells amazing. I love the smell of this in here. It, it reminded me so much of uh, Runts. It was my runts throwback, and I shared it with other people. So the thing is, bananas, as we know them today, are actually a hybrid, for one thing, but it's also, they don't exist. The banana that a lot of our food uh, is flavored after is an older type of banana. You could do more research. This is, I'm just pulling it up from memory or whatever, but I forget the name of the banana, but it's a type of banana that went extinct, and... Basically, since our banana has been so modified, it could happen again to our bananas. <laughs> like, and then, sorry, it, the bananas that we know now could get infected with a severe thing that could affect all the bananas, and then they'd have to hybrid another banana. But anyways, Pacifica, they have some really nice smelling different perfumes. I don't think this is one of my favorites. The Island Vanilla, I think, is actually my favorite. That smell is one of my favorites. Favorite, favorite, favorite. And then what else do we got? Terra's Way. This is okay. I usually prefer Biochem for taste and flavor-wise. Spry. I don't chew gum anymore. I don't like the repetitive jaw action. 
I don't like that this also has lecithin in it, carnauba wax, natural flavors, not a fan. Calcium carbonate probably could interfere with absorption of other, other uh, minerals. I'm not a fan of gum. Hit me up if you want that on Instagram. Yeah, vanilla, that's the way to do it. Like it. Like it a lot. Alright, there's more spry green apple mint. What do we got in here? Gum, natural flavors, peppermint oil, malic acid, calcium carbonate, vegetable glycerin, soy lecithin. Soy lecithin. Don't like it. Why does everything have to have soy? No more soy. I mean, I guess that's a good thing about this one. It says sunflower lecithin, not soy. All right. Lichen plant. You want to put a lichen deodorant on? I don't know. I think I've tried this, and I don't think it's worth its weight. But, yeah, I think that's about it for the samps. If you guys are local in the springs, hit me up and I could send these to you, drop them off to you, you could pick them up for me, whatever. Um, but yeah, that looks like all of them. Stay healthy, guys.